Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. It's your boy King in the building, and this is a quick video. I'm gonna try to go over it. I'm gonna try to show you guys my skills, what I use, why I use it, and this is not by any means the best skill rotations, but the best skills of PvP, the best nothing. This is what I like to use and what I prefer. So Without further ado, let's get it going. Let me show you guys starting with my skill tree. I prefer Succession over Awakening. Why? Simple. They both gonna grind fast, they both gonna do the thing, they are both gonna kill people in PvP, but as a wizard, you are meant to be a range class. And for PvP Succession, this right here combined with this right here is amazing okay and close range this bad boy this bad boy this bad boy and this bad boy anyways let's start with the skill tree that I use for succession before we get into any other details I got my fireball right here main one I chose this one because it does more damage um, I know this one has a knockdown or whatever but for PvP this is not the opening if I use this it's because already you on the floor um, so I'm going with the most damage because when you on the floor I'm gonna hit you with this and you are gonna die after hit you with this I go to this rotation I'll show you later anyways I got this meteor over this one there's a few things I like more this one is obviously um, more damaged right away because it just lands and it hits you 1500 by 11 by times 10. This one is uh, 1382 times 4 and then the other one, you know, you start shaking, duh, 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 stunning people and then it hits you with the 1544 times 6, right? But this, the area of effect is really high and it goes really far away I just find this one very very useful it does a ton of damage and I kill a lot of people with it I just put up a video for PvP and if you go over there you'll see that every time I drop that is is insane damage um, this is useless if you struggling with your skill points don't even bother with this I don't even use this um, I don't even know. It says magic DP minus 15, but I don't use that at all. I don't care for it. Now, when it comes to the lightning, obviously, you're lightning. Out of this two, this is the difference pretty much. Um, this one has more, hit, more mm, hits or skills, whatever. Pretty much, it's good for PvP at long range. Like if you're doing battle arena, battlefield and you have a group far away this is perfect because you all the way in the back and you have more range hits than this one but the problem with that is that when you are close or mid range you you don't have enough power with this one to kill somebody fast this one is not going to kill somebody fast um, close range it's going to hit them ahead and you're going to feel like you're not doing much but this right here, close range 1v1s or large groups, you still have like two hits long range, but one of them is like close. Like if you see in the animation, it's going to throw that one. It's not too far away. The one that is very spread out, but it hits harder. So I chose that one. And then you got this two um, lightning things. If you want it, a lot of people go with this one because you got the forward guard while using it. But I just don't like to charge anything. It's not my style of sitting there and charging a skill. I just want to boom, hit you with it, bomb from far away, hit you with it really far. Um, distance, that's what I'm, I go for. And it works really good. It works great. Um, out of this right here, why do I choose this one over this one? I mean this one over this one why is the area of effect around me this one is in front of you and it's f 
fine by all means you got super arm 1102 by 5 but this right here you got more damage 1460 10 by 5 and is um it freezes on hit like this that that's the main thing it freezes you on hit this one doesn't freeze you it just reduce your movements your movement speed you don't know how many times I get away from people with this like when they knock me down and I'm able to actually get up I would throw this down freeze them and just either kill them or walk away this is a must for me um, what do I choose this with this tool it doesn't even matter I hardly use any of them on PvE or PvP, um, yeah. So I don't, I don't know. I mean, I like this one better because if I'm gonna use something, I probably use this when I'm far away in PvP and throw it in a group. But I really don't use it much. I'll forget. Now the right side scales. Why do I use this? And because it's a combination of PvE and PvP. Uh, currently, right now, I have this thing, the Secret Book of Old Moon. That I could change my skills back and forth, but if you don't have this, you're gonna have to get stuck with whatever. Um, unless you use one of those Armstrong, whatever things to change this. But why this one over this one, right? This is good for PVE 1v1 escape situation. You move back, you um, you um, stiffness, um. On PvP, whatever you use, uh, they stiffness, whatever. This one, I, I tend to like it a lot. I don't know. I know it's not the best ideal situation for PvP when it comes to maybe one v one, but as a group PvP, I just cast this, and you know, he he puts the PvP people on stiffness, and he does pretty good damage, and also it gives me a lot of magna back when I'm PvE in so I go for this one uh, I use this a lot hello um, yo 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 no, give me one second I, I, I use this a lot on PvE 1v1 PvP 1v1 but and it's really good but I don't come across a lot of PvP 1v1s I do battlefield and I do PvE so for me right now this is working better um, what do I use against this too? I have this one right now because of the floating. Okay, so if you want PVE, you're trying to get away, you pop this, and you might float your enemy. That's your safe point, or you're or you're gonna kill him. You understand? Know this one it has a straight range, which is pretty good, and taking you know, and it does floating only on PVE, but you want to use this one. This is like your P you're not gonna use this on PVE. This is your PVP. Um, another escape route or uh, floating effect on the enemy so you could kill them all right um, from this four skills uh, for me that, that one looks cool though right for me it's a no-brainer this right here is an area of effect around you it makes them you know it gives me casting speed and it gets all evasion minus 15 percent on them so that's that right there by itself it's really good this one doesn't do any of that so mm -mm. i mean this one is compared to this my bad i think you could choose from this two or this two where is it let me see oh yeah from this to this two so this one doesn't do any of that so it's a no-brainer to go with this plus so the casting speed is pretty good if you do cancellation and all that um, between these two bad boys a lot of people go with this because how fast you cast it in front of you um, but I tend to I don't know let me see we're gonna try this on PvE real quick we're gonna try this on PvE and see how it works because I really haven't I like this one a lot because the mine is evasion thing but if you hit them with this the evasion does not stack it resets so you're gonna you're gonna get the 20 minus percent of movement but the evasion is just resets pretty much um, it's not like you're gonna take 15 with this one and 15 with this one 
So we're going to try this one to take all the AP to see something real quick. And then that's all the skills for for succession. Now, sages uh your skill enhancements, I got the healing. I just added this. I actually had um what is it called the sages um sages rage because that was my opening skill for any um, PVE or a lot of PvP situations. It, it gives me magic DP plus is a knockdown on anyone. Um, so that was my opening. But I noticed that because I was using this, I will pop this and then the explosion will continuously go right after it. So I never was using this. Never. I had it on the quick slot right here, but I never used it. So. I just said to myself, you know what, I'm going to replace Sages with this and just pop this bad boy on the quick slack that I was using Sages. So now I still have the two fireball that I was using and um, they're not bad on on, the, on when it comes to the damage stuff. This one is a knockdown on PvE, a stiffness on PvP. So it's either if I stiff you or knock you down, you're going to have a problem regardless. So this is actually doing some effect on PvP as well. Um, and it says, you know, stiffness, blah, blah, blah. The damage now is 1232 times 3. But if you charge it for one second or two, whatever, it's 1232 um, times 5. This one is uh, 986 times 6. So it's pretty much the same damage when it's charged. This one is charged. But the difference is this one is every 7 seconds. Okay. And this one is every 3 seconds. So I could throw this one twice as fast than this one. So the damage pretty much multiplies. You know, it can be really good for long range BVP situations. And um, so I changed the healing. I think it's going to be a lot more useful. And for this, I just added this as well. Uh, and I'm trying it on PvE. This is something you're not going to use on PvP, I don't think. But I'm trying it on PvE. And total um, skill points right now is 2,225. So, there goes my skills rotation on here, on the main side. You know what to get, obviously. Um, this is a must. This is a must. Um, you got to have your your magic shield you gotta have your speed spell um, this is actually a must because because of this you gotta pay attention this says uh, it says something about the other blizzard uh, let me see let me see let me see I don't know where I saw it but it says something about because if you have this one right here it would do more damage or something I'm not sure I don't remember where I saw it but believe me he said it I'm not going crazy um, oh it says it right there you see after learning what the green letter says after learning new to blizzard hole a bit to repeat quick no no that's not it anyways whatever now let me show you a real quick um, PVE um, rotation that I like to use I don't have any buffs or anything like that let me just get my pets out because every second you do something here you don't want to lose money anyways what I do in PvE if you're in an area like this that you cannot kill them too, f too fast like I could kill them fast what I like to open is with fireball right I knock them down and I just go into my lightning rotation Pretty much, it's very simple. Oh, I forgot I had the other one. Oh, oops, okay, hold on a second. I have to, um, you see, that, that one is, it's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Let, let's try this again. I forgot I had that one on me. So you throw the thing on the floor, right? You open with fireball, boom, boom. Then you go into your lightning rotation. You hit them with this, and you hit them with this, and then that's it. If they are still alive, you throw some of this on the floor, 
that's the one I just added. I'm still testing that out. If anybody's alive, you can hit them with the with this. Ah, I, li I like that skill. What I want to try is if that skill is um, AOE behind me. So we're gonna we're gonna do this again. Fireball, boom, boom, knock them down into your lightning effect. Okay. Okay, 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 I see. So th that's like what I like to do. Um, obviously, I just changed one of my skills, so I'm trying to see how it works. But um, fireball, lightning, into that, into that. If they're not dead yet. And this is the one I'm trying to. It does a lot of damage on PvE. Pretty good, not bad at all. This would die a lot faster. If you have any buff on you. Okay. You don't want to fight one person. Just move on to the next mob. And this is for mobs that you having a little bit of problem killing. If you if you fight in a mob, let me see something. If you fight in a mob that you can kill really easy, that my rotation would be simple. Like I go to Sherry Sherry Cans over there in Dre in Dregan, and uh, my rotation all I do is two skills. This two, cause I one shot them with those skills. I two shot them pretty much using two skills. And that's it. I constantly use that just to keep grinding really fast. People ask me, um, succession is better, but it's slow grinding. It's not really slow grinding at all. Depends what you're grinding at. You know? Look at this right here. They're like, they, um, I'm here grinding slow because I'm showing you guys. I don't have any buff or anything. I'm just um, cruising to this just so you can see my what rotation I like to use. Your lightning is the your go to. Oh shit, that's it. I thought he was gonna do another thing. You know, that's I'm just showing you guys, but um, I can kill these guys pretty fast, and I can move on pretty fast to the next rotation. Look how fast they die. that's it man and that's it now for PvP look you can start with this as well and and then boom boom get them boom 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 and there you have it boys that's my PvE rotation they died no problems Hold on, let me go back over here so I can talk about PvP real quick. Kill these two guys real quick. Um, yeah, if you have any question about the PvE side of it, you can ask me. I think I'm going to leave that skill just for the heck of it um, to try it on PvP. So I can take minus 10 AP on people. That would be nice. Anyways, on PvP I have a video that I was just doing Red Battlefield. You can see how I play PvP and how it changes. But pretty much, this is this is it right here. This is your go-to. And if you knock somebody down or use stiffness or whatever, if you want to, you know, teleport real quick, drop this too, and get out again if you don't kill them or whatever. Good. This is your lifesaver when it comes to um, anyone next to you. You want to freeze them. A lot of people don't have freezing, um, <coughs> you know, freezing, um, you know, they can block freezing. They don't have a, 
defense for freezing high defense I use this once in a while but um this right here will freeze motherfuckers next to you and then from there you take it when they on the floor bound bound and this three you knock somebody on the floor you want to do this this and this three and they should die mind you I was just doing PVE right here this is my my gear and I hope you like it. if you have any questions please let me know if you have any suggestion what I could do better to improve myself please let me know by all means I hope you like the video and uh, take care subscribe for more peace